What's going on everyone, Anime Analyst here, and after a whole weekend of playing Naruto Storm 4, I'm finally ready to get my first impressions of the game. Now, did this game live up to the hype? Is it the perfect storm? Is it what we have been craving ever since we got left with that game called Naruto Revolution, which was an atrocity and basically damaged the community as a whole? Is this the savior? Does this game redeem? the ultimate ninja storm series okay i'm gonna break it down this way the game is amazing um coming from my point of view i'm really a battle fanatic like i love the battle mechanics of the game i really don't care about the story and all the other little bullshit but i'm mostly here to play the fighting system and play the online but before we get into that before you do anything in the game you're most likely gonna run through the story mode so the story mode is pretty dope i mean it's not like you have to run through those little uh the slow running phases it's just battle after battle after battle there's a trail that you follow and it's just battles and there's a whole bunch of cutscenes that are like animated cutscenes but the one flaw with story mode that was just so fucking bad was the still images that you had to watch instead of actually animating the scenes that was why did they put that in the game at all? I Nobody wants to sit through that. Like, I had to skip through so many cutscenes just because I don't care for these still images, bro. Like, all my friends said, that's like a PowerPoint, fam. Like, nobody wants to sit through that. But besides that, the story mode was kind of lit. I mean, there was only a couple battles in there I liked. It was most, to me, I don't know if it's for y'all, if y'all some story mode PvE type people. Uh... There was only a couple battles that actually like got me hyped, but after I beat the story, I just wanted my characters because you had to beat the story to get most of the characters that you need. So, uh, the story aside, let's talk about the uh, adventure mode real quick. The adventure mode is basically the slow running uh, little phase that you have that was in the other other games. That mode is complete garbage. Play it if you want to unlock uh, for completionist sake and unlock all the little items that you can collect in the game and do a whole bunch of little tasks. I think there's DLC for that mode later in the future too, like the Shikamaru and Gara stuff. I think there's DLC for the adventure mode, but adventure mode is really booty. I mean, you don't really have to mess with it if you don't want to. Now, let me get to the meat, the straight meat of the game for me, the online battles. Now, the online battles, well, the combat in general is straight boss i mean we got the new mechanics the leader switch that shit is so fun because you can mix up and uh, produce different strategies with different characters and you actually start to use characters that you don't normally use that much because it's not like you have to play them the entire match and you can just use the assets that you want them for so the online mode everything about the online is fun except this they took out spectator mode in endless tournaments everything like that if you're in an endless and the max capacity for a endless lobby is four people and you can't even watch you sit there in the lobby the whole time while others are fighting this has crippled the online uh, community for the game and uh, we have a petition out right now to go get that fixed but yeah all that aside the game is dope I'm really enjoying it they really like optimize each character to make them actual actually realistic in combat like all those slow characters they kind of sped them up so they like, they can have competition with the other characters so i mean with that being said you got the collectibles you got online you can do your ninja info card add a voice to your info card for your favorite characters stuff like that uh, do presets there's a bingo book for people to take out online there's special events like it says right now i'm looking at this shit you get double the points uh double ninja items today because it's uh sarutobi hiruzen's birthday the third hokage that's so fucking sweet like we have events for the online stuff so it actually encourage people to play so that's really it my first impressions i love the game i'm playing uh i want to get very competitive with this game and do a lot of series on my channel uh, that's just the type of person I am, but yeah, that's my first impressions of Naruto Ultimate, no, Naruto Shippuden, Ultimate Ninja Storm 4. Go pick the game up. Uh, most of you are going to be getting the game today, considering the, well, tonight, well, 
technically in the morning since the official release date for north america is uh, february 9th so i hope to see you guys online it's definitely going to be a fun time because all these uh other dudes are scrubs online and i really have no one to play and rent uh with that being said leave a like if you enjoyed the video and subscribe if you haven't i'm out of here guys peace <laughs>